What's up, everybody? I've got a fucking headache. Yum, bum, boom, bum. Did you find a way to connect the power cell? The scientist Milo is gonna do it. Very good. Well then, are you ready to leave this planet? Sure. I think so. And there's no time to waste. Dog! Mila, you're... Yes, yes, I know. My legs, I know. Luckily for me, I accomplish more without these things than you have with them. Fair. <laughs> okay, now I suggest you stand back so I can get to work on this ship. There. Ship power will now be soaking up that battery you gave me. I was also able to connect most of my custom rig from the lab to power the ship software. It's ready to go, right? I always knew this day would come, but now that it has, I'm... Am I nervous? It was weird breaking the comfort of my routine, but that's what a great adventure should do. Everyone. Hop aboard! Let's do it! Are we ready? Okay, everyone, hold on! Powering up! Sticking in the main boosters! We going to space. Space, space, space. Do you feel it as we're riding up through the atmosphere? We're going higher than ever before. Hey guys, you're not gonna believe this. Come on up front. Wow. I don't know how, but it worked. Look at it. it. Might have just been out here, but for me, it's been years. Do I remember how it looked, but to remember how it feels? Ain't it wonderful? Sure is. You know, this technically makes us fugitives a dream for, right? We're not supposed to be using this type of technology. But you know what? worth it. I come with you, I signed up for your crazy plan, huh? The next stop, Neo? Plan to get a warp drive, you sure it will work? I literally have zero idea. It will work. Well, can't argue with that. Just so you know, we don't have to head there straight away. We can explore for a bit first, you know. Just talk to me when you're ready to get going. Congratulations, welcome aboard your new ship. You may not board your ship from most available save points. From here you can save your game craft and take control of the ship. You can also feel free to check in and talk with available crew members. When you're ready, talk to me, love to take control of the ship. New quest, the warp drive. Let's talk to Marty Pot. Hey, Doug. Tell me more about Dream Corps. So what are the Dream Corps agent? Oh! Ahem. Dream Corps is not reliable for any damages caused or created by interactions with members of the Dream Corps organization. No, I mean, what are those agents? Robots? Robots? No! But, sorta. Dream Corps agents and employees are members of the Mo Godo race. Agents are almost entirely enhanced with technology. 
A natural born intelligence, however, still lies at their center. <laughs> if they could engineer one of those, they probably would. What can I tell you? What I can tell you is that Dreamcore spends most of its time saving species like yours from certain extinction. But why? Dreamcore is not reliable for any damages caused or created by interaction with members of the Dreamcore organization. <sighs> boom, boom. I wish to be left alone. <sighs> Alright, Mila. So, we trust this Mr. Malefactor? I guess you need a work drive from this place, but what's he looking for? Also, your furry friend, Boom Boom? Is he okay? He seems a bit overwhelmed. Alright, well... What's up, Doug? Impressive work? How'd you learn to do all this? You didn't come to Galaxy Land with your parents, did you? Trigger! Yeah, me neither. My parents were scientists. The best around. Actually, my dad was technically a computer engineer. Point is, it's easy to learn things if you talk from a young age. Plus, this is always what I've wanted to do. Doesn't matter if it's Earth or Eros. So I get to work, so I gotta work when I got here. Hmm. Remember three sets of these spare parts, blah, 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 blah. Okay, look around. Hey, controller ship! Hey, you will! Ah! <coughs> oh, I'm flying! Okay, dog, where to? Neo is the illuminated planet to our northeast. We don't have to go straight there, do we? I've always wanted those is that big ice ball, Arcos. I know of an outpost on Arcos that is safe for landing. It could be beneficial before attempting to steal the warp drive. There's a human there that can provide supplies. You're called, Doug. Uh. Um, um, um. So what is the big uh, lava dragon over here? Nope, nope. Ah! Okay, never mind. I leave you alone. Um, um, um. We're definitely taking a side trip to Arcos. But was there another planet over here? What's that? Symphony of the Star. Recommended level of coal. Go through 19 to 25. I'm only level 6. Alright, let's go to the ice ball. Lush of fantastic world brimming with magic. Oh wait, is that Arcos? The huge ball? Trying to transport bots roaming the land off with the only bomb means the transmitting putting underground bases. Okay. I'm not very high level, so... Whoa! Whoa! <clears throat> Is that a walking city? Wait, nothing else to do up here.
Outpost 359. Hey, some fellow humans! Well, that was a welcome sight! I'm turbulent, and I'm lucky enough to be in charge of this outpost. What brings you here? It's our first time on Arcos. Then welcome! Yeah, I suppose there's a few things you should know. You feel that weight on your shoulders? Gravity's a lot stronger on Arcos than any other planet in Galaxy Land. Not only that, but go ahead and take some nice deep breaths in. Notice anything? That's 35% oxygen you're breathing. Keeps you going, you know? Ah! Whoa. Is that... a penguin? Sure is. Dreamcore thinks that just because there's a few humans on our coast that we're here to raise it. I didn't know first thing about penguins. I don't have the time either. Hey, wait. You're a human. You're probably better at raising these things than I am. I'll tell you what. You prove that I can trust you with a simple task and I'd be happy to place the penguin in your custody. Penguins sounds like a lot of responsibility. Hey, okay, Quixley! Yes. Explain to them what you did. I had an error of judgment. Quixley here forgot to change the batteries on the lift to the lower lab. Now someone's had to go and take the long way around. That's where I thought you might come in. If you can swing this battery down to the lab and power the power lift back up. That penguin's got your name on it. Penguin sounds like a lot of responsive. Hey, Quixley! Yes. You're off the hook! These folks will bring the battery down for you. Thank you, visitors. Talk to Quixley when you're finished swapping out that battery. Oh. Bye. Nothing. They grow plants here? Interested in our process? Many species brought to the galaxy then exhibit very specific diets. Bases like these are used to design and generate food suitable for such beings. There's just one thousands located on our coast. You know, so used to serve in similar role in galaxy land, but is now in the process of being terraformed for some alternative purpose. Ba-da-dum, ba-da-dum, ba-dum, boom. Hold on, hold on. Got it. Gotcha. Oh, I should have taken a picture. Too late. Oh, wait, hold on. I can take a picture. Get out of there! What? Oh, water and fire. Oh, water puts out fire. Got it. All right. 
Should be able to capture it, right? No? Damn it. Oh, I'll try capturing the next one. Thing. Yes, I don't. Thought I did. Gotcha. Should be able to capture that one. Oh, come on! Show it. We gotta heal. can go back up. See if we can capture this fucker. Often. Ah. I block your soften. With Gorilla Roar. Okay, soften me again then. Yes, perfect. Perfect. Uh, capture the fish. Uh. 
Oh, I almost threw up. I am feeling horrible today. Not fun. Yeah, I missed multiple spots. <coughs> oh, God. I just need to go straight down. And then somehow I gotta get over there. Also, is this not the right way that I'm supposed to be going? We can just kill this one. Oh, you dead next turn. Dead. Let's be this way. Throw legs. But not, oh my goodness. Okay, well. That tonic boom boom. Uh. Here you go, tonic dog. There we go, we're back on track now. Slash. God damn it, boom boom, don't miss. Damn it, Zach, don't miss. Oof. 
fucking up. Drink it, Doug. Okay. We gotta heal you up, guys. There we go. <laughs> We're out of here. <coughs> I'm out of here. Looks like we should place the battery. One moment. That should do it. Let's get our reward. Can't hide that gold coin from me. Surface level, F plus stuff. <coughs> I don't know why I need a penguin, but I need a penguin. I need one. Absolutely. You make your way to the you should make your way to the loading bay if you haven't already. Just behind you. My buddy Big Ernie will take care of you. We're about to send off the planet's latest landwalker on her debut voyage. I see you've had success in accomplishing your task. I thank you. Please take the lift to come see me in my lab below if you find the spare time. Craft and may mutually benefit. And yes, the penguin is yours. What, what do penguin do? <laughs> okay. You should be, oh yeah, okay. Alright, let's go check out the loading bay. Okay, slowly now. Slowly or you'll piss it off. Enough, shut it down. We'll try again after it's calmed down. Hey, more humans. I like that. What brings you here? It's in cargo. What's that you're transporting? Well, this thing here? That's a snow thrasher. Don't worry, it's a bark is a whole lot worse than its bite, I think. Also acting up because it's scared is all poor thing. We'll get it back home soon enough. Giant machinery? I don't know giant walking machines behind me. <coughs> sure is. Our latest land walker. Wouldn't be interested in hopping aboard for a maiden voyage, would you? Could always use extra hands. Or paws, whatever it is you got in your crew. Got a bit more work to go before she's ready for her first trip. Not to mention some cargo needs to be loaded up. Maybe a routine to be over to the nearest outpost, but we still need to prep. <laughs> Head back here in a few weeks, Earth time, if you're interested in hopping aboard. Okay. <sighs> What's this do? Like I said! We still got some prep work to do, but head back here when you're ready. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, big yeah, I got you. Okay, bye, Ernie. What's there you doing in his lab? And that goes down to the 
ice tunnels. Let's go talk to Quixley. He said he had a thing to do. Yo, Quixley, I got a thing I want to know. What do you need me to do? What do you need, buddy? Visitors, thank you for returning to my lab. I wish to present you with an opportunity. It is quite simple. When you were replacing this battery, did you encounter the ice elementals along the way? These beings present an opportunity to create a form of energy that is quite literally alive. You can find and capture the three elementals located around Galaxy Land. Perhaps I'll be able to fuse their properties into a single entity. That is to say, bring me an ice, fire, and bolt elemental, yes? Should the experiment be a success, I'll allow you to keep the results. Ah. I never captured an ice elemental, though. I want to try to capture a nice elemental while I'm here. Let's, you know what? Why not? Sounds like my cat just took a shit and it's not the pleasant smell. Take hey, him down here. Stole that bitch. Capture it. Yeah, we got it. Just gotta get around again. Might as well get a level up while we're down here. Now we can just kill. Almost dead. No, you can't kill Bobo. 
We're good. We're out of here. Fuck, I'm gonna go that way. Already fucked up. Already fucked up. Well, hey. Might as well get the level up that this will get us. Think so. And dead. Level up. We gotta go. We gotta level up out of the place. We got a bunch of summons. You know, wah wah. Hi, Doug. Kill it. Oh, you're dead next turn. Soften us all you want. We're too hard for you. Gotcha. Look at that. Easy peasy. I don't think so. Come on, come on, kill the fucking fish. Let's eat some fucking sushi tonight. They took the long rail around. I'm leaving. Bye. You're a cool axolotl species.
Let's get out of here. Here you go. Let's get out, let's get out, let's get out of here. Okay, but like this place though. I gotta know. They didn't even talk about this place, but I can land here. Whoa. Okay, here's the clearing we spotted. This is the clearing? I can hardly see anything. It looked more obvious from above. The entire planet is covered with an impossibly dense forest. Is it even safe being here? We get our own ship and we're not willing to just explore around a little bit? This is the fun part. Right! Remember, knowledge is power. And who knows what you might find. Right! I'll be up top listening in on the comms. If you need anything, just give me a shout. Let's go! What's backwards? Always get far too dense in this direction. Okay. <clears throat> I can see. Cool statue. Am I gonna have to fight it? Hey, Mila. Actually, it was a clearing right in front of where you dropped us off. Really? I don't see one from up here. Your fire tailing just looks like one big forest. Like, literally 200 feet from where you dropped us. By this, like, night statue thing. The sun is beaming through. Hmm. What's strange is... We're on the side of the planet without any sunlight at all. These woods must adhere to some strange rules. Wait! I see it now, the clearing. Not very odd. You would find it by zoning in on your location. And wherever you are, I'm able to track. Treasuring your spores, am I right? <laughs> in other words, things get weird, you need to be picked up, just let me know. Okay, thanks, we'll let you know. Doug, look! Hey, little guy. We come in peace. Anything interesting we should be looking for around here? <laughs> well... I guess not. Oh, look! It brought friends! I gotta scan that. And that frog! Killer wasp. Toes toad. Holy shit, that does a lot of damage! Oh, thank God. Okay, not as much damage. Uh... That's fun. Woo! Now what? The creature that ran off seems to know his way around here. Let's chase after it.
Okay. Oh, back into the darkness. Huh. Is it? What is it? Interesting. It appears to be reacting to our presence. Likely the tree is intricately linked to this forest. Further study would most certainly prove useful. Approach the tree. What just happened? Left. Stay true. Green ring. Okay. Is there a specific combination of paths I have to take when I'm in that area? Oh, we use one of my chances. What if I keep going? this time. And then right again. Gotcha. Oh shit. Go baby raptor. Oh wait, shit. I want to capture these things. Don't sleep me. Stop it. Damn it. Okay, hey, he's back up. That's fine. Drink this, Doug!
Come on, get the toad, get the toad. Yeah! I got the toad, new summon those toad. There's another glyph! Okay. What about if I go right, left, right? Huh? That shouldn't think of that, huh? Okay, now there's still another apple. No, we're gonna go left, right, left. Left. Right. Left. Right. Oh. Nothing. Okay, so that one didn't work. Now we'll go the other way. <clears throat> the combination does matter. Uh... Hey, little guy, come back! Hello? Definitely a bar. Look at the tiny door. the little guy first. I do kind of want to look down that... Uh, no, just follow the guy. Hello? It's a tag. Racco has already informed us of your arrival. We are all so excited by your presence. You are? It was a time to arrive at. Tonight's presentation is the very history of this village. Here, here, go have a look. But please remain silent during the performance. Racco, please lead them to their seats. As the long moon cast its light upon the land, a crystal rose from the darkness. It grew stronger with each passing day, infusing life into the world around it. However, its gifts created an imbalance, and a knight was born with a desire for destruction. And so, just as the crystal gave, the night destroyed. Hawk! 
The night awakens. It cannot be. Nay, it be true. And it marches towards this very spot. Oh, who will stop this wretchedness? For if the crystal be destroyed before sunrise, our harvest will surely fail. Here the night be now! We must act for the beast will be vulnerable before the moment as it's cast a strike upon the crystal. Go now! I will defend the crystal! Halt the show! I can hardly believe it. The night awakens. A spirit embodies the night once more. It approaches! I'm gonna have to fight that, aren't I? The cycle begins again. Once more has the story shown itself to be true. We must band together if we hope to overcome this evil. Tonight, we don't let it destroy us. The feast shall continue as planned. <sighs> we must be brave and stand our ground against this evil. The night looms over us like a dark cloud. The ancient night has risen again. Truly a day I thought I'd never see. Wait! Visitors, where are you going? I've only just heard the news. Please, he must have you a feast in the meat hall. Okay. I don't see anything else I can do right now. So, you're the noble heroes my son claims will defeat the knight. Rocco has already filled us in on the details. We are ever so- We are ever so thankful. So very thankful. Defeat the knight? I'm not sure we said- So very thankful! To the heroes from afar! The heroes from afar! I hear you attended our annual play. You had an ear to listen, you may have heard of the knight's weakness. You must wait until it attempts to deal its killing pro to our precious crystal. Only then will it enter the mortal realm and be vulnerable to an attack. You've seen our town crystal, correct? You may learn more about the crystal's importance by speaking with our local healers at the church. Regardless, it takes some time for the knight to reach march across Moonfall. For now, we must wait and indulge in the splendor of your arrival. Bless you, Rocco, for bringing them here. Great. Rocco chooses not to speak by choice. Silent Rocco, we call him. Nevertheless, he has so much to say. We're so proud of him. And blessed is this day the great heroes were sent here to save Moonfall. We thank you, heroes. You must devise a plan to defeat a crystal before it blah blah blah. Okay. Oh. I go down cause I don't know where to go. Gotta see where the path leads to and fro. Really, you're here for having had a bad feeling for this woman back? Yeah, okay. Bye. That's pretty good. Uh. 
Maybe next time. Diggity doggity boogity bop, bobbity bobbity boopity bop. A bit a bop, ba da ba da ba di di da ba da. Bit a da mum bop, ba da ba da ba ba da ba. Do ba da ba di di da ba da 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 di da. Ma ba ba da 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 do da ba da 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 da. You must be the hero. Oh, it's rare we have visitors to these hollow grounds. And defeating this knight would be no easy task. So it's a crystal magical or something. These crystals form over time as the particles in the air condense. They consist of the very energy and nutrients to keep this planet sustained. Once the long night is over, the crystal will shed its gift onto our land. Should the sun rise and the crystal be destroyed, our crops will not yield. And so the knight seeks to doom our people into starvation. We thank you for volunteering to stop this bow, but it will not be easy. You best prepare well. Now may I assist you? <laughs> How far away is it? Not moving. How long does it take him to move? Tales of Night Awakening every century be true. What other magical beasts might follow? <coughs> Black. Right, I understand if you know more. I'm really not sure that we. To the heroes, to the heroes. To us. Grand thing to say, Rocco. Okay. Well, I can't see we do anything for now. <clears throat> so I wonder if I just leave and come back. He's not moving. Recommended level 26. I never found the spare parts on Arcos. is not going to be some walk in the park. You sure you're ready for this? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's get to it. Probably save once we land, though. Okay, we're about to break through. The hangar. 
see it. I mean, that's supposed to be ice down there. We're coming in hot. The first platform. Drop us there. Okay, I'll wait, for, I'll wait here for as long as I can. You guys go grab that drive. Isn't anybody gonna try and stop us? Dreamcore is slow to handle any disruptions in the upper city. Events of this nature rarely occur. It's really only the humans that ever try this stuff. <sighs> well, there he goes. Technically, he never said he'd help us. We even know what business he has here. Doug, you sure about this? I guess we have to be. Oh, driver's only chance of getting back to Earth. Let's get going. Humans in the upper city. You must be up to something crazy, huh? A human here. How strange. Have you been told of your home on arrows? You're not supposed to be here. Please do us no harm. I don't know when you should ask this, but could I get your autograph? Just sign it to Dave from Human. Alright, I feel like I should head back and save. Yeah, I'm gonna go save, because I still gotta play some Bendy. Still got a headache. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Nostratep playing Beyond Galaxy Land. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, you're having a great morning, night, even day, but your birthday. Hope it's a great one. Love you guys. You're beautiful as hell. Uh, take care of yourselves. Stay spooky. Stay weird. Keep it awesome. Keep it saucing. I feel like shit. Alright. Till next time. Bye. Blah, 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 blah.